ladies and gentlemen welcome back and today we're going to be playing the smiling man where a smiling man will be chasing as you can see so without further ado let's go ahead and jump right into it though so many years ago i lived in the center of a large city in usa as i have always been a, a night person i often get bored <clears throat> after i have to get bored after my roommate who was decidedly not a night person went to bed to pass the time i used to take long walks and spend the time thinking Spent four years like that walking alone at night and never once had a reason to feel afraid. I'm always used to joke with my roommate that even the drug dealers in the city were polite, but all of that changed just a few minutes of one in evening. It was a Wednesday somewhere between 1 and 2 in the morning, and I was walking near a police patrol park quite a ways from my apartment. It was a quiet night, even for a week night, with very little traffic, almost no one on foot. The park, as in most nights, was completely empty. Ooh, spooky. This has to be, um, okay, shift to run, interact, okay, basic controls. <clears throat> Wednesday, 2 a.m. Uh, I'll probably cut all of it out, man, but good God, that was the longest intro I've ever had of any game, man. Um, okay, it says shift to run, but it's not letting me run right now, so I guess we're just kicking it. But basically, all the intro was saying was uh, you're a night person, so you decided to go take a stroll at 1 or 2 a.m. at night uh, <clears throat> through a park, which seems to be how all of these games usually go. For some reason, we, uh, our people love to, uh, what is that? After a long time of walking, we seem to love walking out at night. We, we, t we make no, the worst decisions possible. Because I don't think anybody does this in actuality. I think we're about to run up on the smiling man, though. It's been a long time. I'm tired. I'd better go home. Okay. Nah. Nothing's happening. Okay. We are now in a city, it looks like. I still can't sprint. I don't know if, they, uh, if they're waiting to give me a chance or what. That car had no sound. That was the most silent vehicle ever. I wonder if I'm going the right way. Well, it's gotta be. Uh, I was walking down a small street to go get back to my apartment when I first noticed at the end of the street there was a silhouette of a man dancing. Oh yeah, this is supposed to be based off of a short horror film as well. I don't see nobody dancing. Does anybody? I don't see anybody dancing. I, it was a strange dance as he danced he took a step forward I guess you could you could say he was dancing coming straight towards me <laughs> okay <laughs> he's kind of hitting that though I can't even lie like look how he's doing his feet like a snake he danced closer still until I can make out his face. His eyes were wide and wild, head to the back slightly, looking off at this guy. His mouth was forming a painfully wide cartoon of a smile. Okay. Well, they making sure we get all. I took my eyes off him to cross the. Across the empty street. Is he watching us? Nah, he's just looking off into the distance. He had stopped dancing and was standing with one foot in the street, perfectly parallel to me. He was facing me, but still looking skyward, smile still wide on his lips. Alright. Is he about to make a dash for it? Because if so, I'm about to hit it too. Oh, he's posed for real. What happens if I walk up on him, bruh? Oh, it won't let me, okay. I was about to say, what if I can just walk up in dude's face and he don't move? Well, we're going to keep an eye on him for sure. Until until I, until I he gets out of distance. See, now I can't see him no more, so let's keep it up. Like. What's happening? I can't move. This ain't me. People don't be carrying guns nowadays or whatever. I 
He had crossed the street and was now crouching slightly. I was so shocked that I stood there for a while looking at him. At this point, you gotta start running, right? He done stood up. He took giant, exaggerated steps on tiptoes, <laughs> on tiptoe like a cartoon character sneaking up on someone. Only he was moving very, very fast. Are we gonna run? Are we gonna run? I guess we're gonna, uh, we gonna ask what he wants. <laughs> Brush this out, tormenting people for the fun of it, I guess. What is you looking at? Oh, I guess you sign relief. I don't know. Can I? I oh, he's he's. Where am I supposed to be? Oh, I'm running straight down. Oh, he's moving. He is moving. Ah! <laughs> he's moving. Is he supposed to be hitting this? I can't do nothing about this. He's just whooping me. He was just whooping me. Like, what was I supposed to do about that? Play again, I guess. All right, we back at it, man. So this time, uh, I ain't turning around to look at him. We're just going to be moving. Don't even look. Stare straight ahead and just keep it moving. Don't even matter if Buddy's right on our, on our tail. Just stay straight. Hey, keep it moving. I'm not looking back. Just keep running. I'm kind of floating. I can't lie. He was moving too, though. All right, that's all you had to do. You can get away from him. I ran until I got off the side of the road and back onto a well-lit, low-traffic road. When I looked back, he was nowhere to be found throughout the rest of the way home. I kept looking over my shoulder, always expecting to see a stupid smile, but he was never there. I lived in that city for six months after that night and never went out for a night stroll again. There was something about his face that haunted me. He didn't look drunk. He didn't look high. He looked completely and utterly insane, and that's a very, very scary thing to see. So we survived instead of him beating us down. So you're not even supposed to turn around and look at it, but you're just supposed to cut out. Now I know there um there was an alternate story, so we're gonna go ahead and hop on that as well. One night I went went to the market to buy something to eat. I do this a few times a week, not only to purchase food, but also to appreciate the nighttime tranquility. But this time was different. I came face to face with evil in its most sinister form. A tall man smiling and radiating a terrifying energy. I left a bit later than usual that night. It was two AM. After that night I never went out again at that hour. Um I don't know about y'all, but me, I don't know anywhere to stay up this late. No grocery store, that is. Maybe a gas station. But, um, I don't know. I don't know about no grocery store staying up in this light. Look at the objectives. Shift the run, move, interact. Okay, cool. If it's another shopping list, bro, I'm going to be like, this is like the, okay, go to the market. Okay. Which one? Is this the right way? I'm going to take this. I'm going to take it as this strong way. Why does everybody need, everybody need to cut that grass? But, um, I thought there was going to be another shopping list game. I was about to say, good guy. That must be the new trend. All right, there goes homie. No lie, they should start off with this one because this is already a little bit creepier. Because why is homie just standing there like that? Don't tell me he's about to be running. We're just going to keep it pushing, bro. Where is this grocery store at? I'm just saying, I feel like after, um, I don't know, in this time and age, I'm not walking outside without a gun, especially now that I know 2 a.m. by myself. Ain't happening. Where am I going? What kind of trip is this? Okay, here goes a quick mark right here. So it is a gas station. At least somebody's working here. Pick up something to buy. 
Uh, pay for what you, pay for what you picked up. So what are we getting, man? Healthy snack shopping list, basic, st special meal shopping list. Uh, you know what? We are gonna keep it cheap, man. Thirteen dollars. We gonna keep it cheap. All right, let's pay. Good good evening. It was thirteen fifty. Let's go ahead and pay you. All right, we heading back on now. Cool. We got our just just a regular, you know, we can eat some scrambled eggs, have some milk with it, or if you want, you know, some cereal. I, it it seems like we just bought straight breakfast, in my opinion. One was breakfast, one was dinner, and then something about some healthy stuff, but we ain't on that. No, uh, we trying to eat good. We ain't trying to eat nothing healthy. I don't got time for none of that. And let's hope, uh, let's hope Buddy's still on his side of the street and has it crossed over. And I also don't remember what house I live in, so that might uh, that might screw me here in the long run. I didn't pay attention to my house, in which all of them look the same. So if it happens to come up that um, I'm having to pick out, choose one on the random, I might end up dying because I don't know what to do. I also don't remember where we saw this guy. How far down the road was it? I feel like we were moving for a little minute though. So we might we might have a little while before he pops up again. Or he's hiding in the corner somewhere and I ain't paid <laughs> Oh my god Oh my god Oh my gosh Are we for real? That's gotta be the wackest thing ever. Why? Wow. Oh. All right, man. Buff, but I'm sprinting. Wait, is this my house? That was my house. Oh my gosh. That is the wildest jump scare ever. Why was he there? Why am I out again? Not just see what happened. All right. At least we know we're all the way at the end of the street this time. Okay. That's what we know for a fact. Why is it, Why am I going out of that? I just went shopping. I mean, shouldn't you shop for the whole week, man? This time we're getting a nice dinner, though. I can't lie. I, I'm, I'm going to try and play off like I just didn't scream my head off with that jump scare that thing was it was scary though i was not expecting buddy to be there like i said i had no clue where i was either all right so we have to do this thing where we have to turn around and sprint this dude real life just goes around torment like he don't even do anything he just torments people all night long and i like how all we do is just let the dude walk up on us every single time We're going to ask the same question as old buddy. What do you want? And he's going to turn around and walk away. Then he's going to come sprint again. How much you want to put on it? I bet, bet some money right now. Somebody bet me some money. I'm putting 20 on it. 20. 20, he comes back sprinting. And we got to run to the house. 20. 20 right now. I, I look, I'm looking way too far low right now. I still can't move. Oh, he ain't coming this time. Oh, no. I'm going to be completely honest. The alternate storyline is better than the main story. Can't even lie. They should have stuck, stuck this one. They should have stuck it with this one. I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. I didn't even see him. I didn't see him. Why is the alternate story? What is this music? Is this the end of the house yet? No. That's the end. That's my house. This is my house right here. That was the house. He's playing with the keys? You gotta get in the house, man.
so we survived. We got the good ending. And I'll tell you, if you die, you get a bad ending. I'll tell you, it's gotta be right. Well, they, you know, they kind of say the good ending. Now I feel like I have to die to see the bad ending, just to see if it gives me like a, a alternate story or ending. Well, obviously it's an alternate ending, but I want to see if there's something else to it. All right, we back in it. I'm not gonna lie. Same way as last time, I cheated, bro. But I gotta see how to get the alternate ending, cause there's no way I'm about to play the game and not see. So what we gotta do is we gotta head straight to the mark. We gotta get to the um. We gotta get to the gas station. I don't know. I'm not turning around. Last time, if you turn around, you died. So I'm staying. I'm just heading straight. Here we are, right here. Get in here. Oh, he done murdered Buddy. He done killed Buddy. Not a cashier's body, bruh. The psycho killed him, man. Huh? He weren't even doing that. What's that? <laughs> Is this the bad ending? All right, we got the two endings, man. I'm happy. My life is complete now. I've done everything I needed to do. 100% completion on the smiling man. Uh, honestly, the alternate story, 10 times better than the main story. They should have just made that the main story and made the alternate story. But uh, no, I, I could have lived without the main story, to be honest with you. This one was a lot better. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, man. If you haven't already, like, comment, subscribe. God bless, and I'll see y'all guys in the next one. Peace.